Hello everyone, welcome to my video. Today, I'm going to show you all the beautiful scenery of the great northern New York state during our winter season of 2023. I will be discussing some fun facts about northern New York as well as taking you on a historical trip into Thompson Park, located in our small city of Watertown, New York. Northern New York, being the very top of upstate New York, lays directly underneath Ontario, Canada and to the right of Lake Ontario. Being as close to Canada as we are, you'd expect our winters to get pretty bad. Well, you're right. For the most part, our winters are very different every single year. Last year was a season full of record-breaking snowstorms. People were stuck in their homes for days because even the snowplows were having trouble getting through all of it on the roads. But this year is extremely different. Yes, we've seen snow, but the longest it stayed was for two whole days, not five feet in less than 24 hours. I was lucky enough to even capture the footage I got from today's video before the weather rose to 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Besides our wild, crazy forecasts, isn't the snowfall gorgeous? It may be cold, but just taking a walk through a snowy path gets you right into the holiday season spirit. Something you'll see a lot of up here in upstate New York is farmland. I got the pleasure of growing up on land that was a farm way back when. Along the property, there are rock walls that separate the property from all of our neighbors. Plus, exploring the property as a child, I had found lots of antique items such as medicine bottles, milk bottles, Coca-Cola bottles, etc. Plus, older vehicles that people had dumped into the woods. It makes the strolls through the trails my mother made feel like a time travel. My next stop is in Watertown, New York, in the famous Thompson Park. This is a park I've been visiting my entire life. It has a zoo, a public pool, a golf course, a playground, and many amazing trails and overlooks. Not only is it a park where many people from surrounding areas come to enjoy their outside activities, but it's also a place that holds lots of history and even some creepy legends that you might or might not believe unless you experience it for yourself. Let's jump into it. According to historicthompsonpark.org, the park was created in 1899 by John C. Thompson. The park was inspired by the Olmsted firm who designed Central Park in New York City and then later Thompson Park. But would the creators of the park know that it would hold a nickname of Watertown's Area 51? Probably not. Apparently, there's an interdimensional vortex that moves throughout the park. Onlyinyourstate.com says, Witnesses have claimed that people have disappeared and transferred to another part of the park. Paranormal investigators have also received very high electromagnetic readings in the park. To make it even stranger is that apparently the government codename for the actual Area 51 in Nevada was Watertown. I personally never experienced anything, but I'm not going to say it that nobody has. I hope you've enjoyed the scenery of our wintry mix this year, the fun facts, and the creepy historical facts of our park here in northern New York. Maybe sometime yourself can come visit the beauty and learn more of our history. Make sure to leave a like, comment your thoughts, and subscribe for another one. Until next time, thanks for watching.